What's up guys, today we've got a brand new FL5 Type R in that we're gonna be installing our titanium cosmic burn color on. But I'm gonna shut up and I'm gonna get to it. So a lot of these new cars, the manufacturer will like paint over the bolts. And what sucks is the first time you go and you take it out, the paint immediately chips. And the more times you take it out, the worse it starts to look. But if you replace it with our stuff, the power is gonna look good every time. All right, so just hitting the pause button really quickly because I want to show you guys. I've done the passenger side of the bay and the hood, and you can now really see just the difference in the OEM versus our titanium hardware. The titanium, especially in this color, pops in this engine bay. So the next thing I'm gonna do is the intake cover that's got the iconic Type R logo on it. I think that's gonna honestly be the biggest difference in this engine bay that's gonna catch your eye every time when I change the hardware on that. So I'm gonna knock that out now. So we've got our hardware kits installed here. We've got our engine bay kit, our engine kit, and our hood kit ready to go. But now we have these ugly plastic clips in this engine bay, and we've come up with a few different ways to replace them in different models. And I'm gonna go through really quickly how we do it in the new Type R. All right, so you'll have your pry tool here. Push it under the clip to pull it up, and that should release it. All right, so we've got the plastic clip out of the Type R here, and this is actually two-piece plastic clip, so it comes apart like that. You'll just need the base, and then you'll need the bolt and washer that goes with it. All right, so then you'll insert the base right back in where it came out of. You'll take the bolt and the washer, place it there, and just push down, and now it's secure. One thing, though, to note is when you go to uninstall this, if you have to, you definitely have to thread it out. You can't pull on it. So you need to back it out like a normal bolt would. Just like that. And you're good to go. All right, so the Type R has got this awesome wing um, in the rear uh, that has six bolts that hold the risers or the wing to the risers. And so I'm just replacing those with our titanium hardware. Going with the gold on the rear just to give it a little bit more pop. We just wrapped up installing our door and seat kit. So we've done the seat anchor points along with our door kit. And what we did on this one was our stage two door kit, which includes the striker plate, the door latches, the hinges, the bolt up here at the fender, and the door checks. But we're gonna have a smaller kit for some of you guys that don't wanna do that much, where it's just gonna be the striker plate and the door latches, the most common places seen. All right, so we just finished installing the titanium hardware on this car and it looks amazing. If you guys are interested in picking up a kit for your FL5, either hit the link below in the description or just head to our website. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.